Some tips to consider before going to a new build, even if you're not thinking about purchasing. The first one is, is that new build in a metro district? This matters because it does affect your payment and your taxes in that area. For example, new builds have in this area, in Colorado, a lot of circumstances where the metro districts allow for trails, parks, and pools. And you really can't purchase a new home without it being in one. Those kinds of things matter. They affect you in many ways. Number two, is the builder's reputation good? In Colorado, there's many builders all across the Front Range, and some of their reputations are better than others. That matters because when you purchase a new home, things go wrong, and you wanna make sure that that builder is going to fix them so that they work in the best possible way, or so that your home is the most secure it possibly can be. Number three, phone a friend. Call your favorite real estate agent. That real estate agent is going to be thrilled that you reached out to them because they can give you the information about the reputation and about the metro district that will help you in order to make decisions, even if you're not ready. When you go into those new builds, the minute you step foot in there, you are considered a buyer, whether you're ready to buy or not. And a lot of times, if you go there without your real estate agent, they will lose, you will lose your ability to work with a realtor for that transaction. It doesn't cost you anything to have a realtor advocating for you, but it does make a huge difference in how the transaction will go if you decide to go in that direction. For example, the salespeople are the eyes and the ears of the seller. They do not work for you. Only your realtor is there to advocate for you. So if something goes wrong, they're the ones that are going to guide you, they're the ones that are going to educate you, and they're the ones that are going to help you get where you wanna be. 